over the last uh, two weeks since we entered phase one, the number of cases in the community has remained stable and under control. I want to take this opportunity to thank everyone for your effort that you've put in, put in to keep everyone safe. We are now ready to move to phase two of our reopening, which will begin after 18th of June. In this next phase, our goal is to ensure that efforts taken during phase one, as well as a circuit breaker to reduce the risk of transmission are sustained. Mask wearing and good hygiene practices remain key strategies in the next phase. Apart from a small list of exceptions, phase two will see the resumption of most activities. Safe management principles will become even more crucial beyond just the rules and regulations. As a default, individuals must maintain safe distancing of at least one meter at all times. Where appropriate, such as at the FMB outlets, dining in, we will allow groups of not more than five to be seated together with one meter safe distancing between tables. There should be no mixing between the groups. Similarly, small group social gathering of up to five person will also be allowed. Within the home, households may also receive up to five visitors at any one point. Basically, it's a rule of five and one, groups of five or one meter apart. All health services, including aesthetic services and elder care services in the community, will resume with safe distancing measures in place. Face-to-face -face visitations at nursing homes will also be allowed with precautionary measures. While the vast majority of activities will be allowed to resume at the start of phase two, the resumption of a small number of activities will take more time. Overseas and local experience has shown that these settings can result in large clusters of infections, which we have to avoid. It is critical that we continue to remain vigilant so as to protect ourselves and our loved ones. This way, our efforts over the last two months will not be wasted. 